As you guys probably know already, the iPhone 13 just came out. Julie and I pre-ordered it and it literally just came in. So we're about to open it up right now. I'm super excited. Gonna like go little kid on Christmas. I know, right? Boom. I got oh. the silver, which actually just looks white on the back and then the sides it looks silver. I, mean, I got blue, the new Sierra blue. Yeah. I've never had a color before. I always get silver, so this is like so new to me. I've had the blue with the previous phone, the 12, but this blue looked a little bit more like baby bluish this year and I wasn't too fond of it. But I saw some videos of people having it in person and it looks a lot better than it did on like the Apple website. So. Yeah, it seems more like a girlier blue yeah. than like the dark blue that you have. iPhone 13 Pro Max, I got the one terabyte. Julia got the 512 gigabyte. Yeah. Yeah, I did not need one terabyte. I do, because I literally just ran out of storage like yeah. a couple days ago on my phone. Yeah, it's so funny. I record a lot of videos, obviously, so there's no more um, packaging around it. They got rid of, you know, like the plastic oh, wrapping. That was always so satisfying. Yeah. Probably for the environment, they yeah. got rid of the plastic, I guess. <gasps> oh, oh, wow, it's like sticking. Look at that. Bam, ooh. I know it's like really bright. Oh my God, this is so pretty. Yeah, I don't know if you can there see. There you go. There's a lot of sun hitting right now. That is so beautiful. Oh, the, the cameras are a lot bigger. You know, they don't come with the charger block anymore, so we have to order that separate, but we got the cord because it's a USB-C. We only have one USB-C block, and I'm using it for something right now, so we, we both ordered new blocks. Yeah. And then, you know, you got some stickers in here, as always. You want to peel it off together? Let's do it. This is so satisfying. And there we go. <laughs> I love doing that. Wow, I've never had a colored phone. Let me see. <gasps> Stop. Oh, that's pretty. I'm gonna power it on. There you go. English, select region, United States, quick start. What up, Cody? Just got our new phones. Did you? Yeah. I was wondering why you weren't texting me back. <laughs> Put it next to my old phone, which is right there, and do the setup process, which last year took like two hours. So set up new iPhone, continue. This is on my other phone. There we go, waiting for other iPhone. Basically I just scan this. Just like a QR code, I'm setting it up. Old phone, new phone, just put the 210 wallet on it and get your wallet at lance210.com. But look at the camera comparison. This one's a little bit bigger than the older model. Time remaining, about six hours. Sick. This is why I didn't do this the year before. Mine says 50, 40 minutes. 51. Yeah, you know why? All of my data is being used on my phone. We have no storage. Today we are headed to Miami. Julia's got her suitcase. I know it's blurry once again. We gotta make sure it all fits in Cody's Tesla because we got our two suitcases and his. You know, this is a charger. It's a charger? Yeah. But it's not a strong charger. It's not a wall charger, but it's a charger. For real? Yeah. What do you do? You just like plug it into an outlet? Uh -huh. For real? Like an outlet in your garage? I think so. Yeah. You can charge it overnight. It'll only add like maybe 50 miles. Which I didn't know that. Yeah, no shot. <laughs> no shot. There's only two. Can I see the front space? Yeah, it's not gonna fit. That's not gonna work, so we gotta take stuff out of our bags and put it into one. All right, now we have it all loaded into one. You know, just eating and watching a movie Let's and a Tesla. Baby. <laughs> Miko Sucky Service Plaza. This sounds like my kind of place. Bruh. <laughs> we gotta stop. Cody's gotta charge up his Tesla and then uh, we'll have like another hour drive to Miami. We've been in, in the car for like two and a half hours. Miko Sucky. Do you know that's a truck? Yeah. Me Sucky Sucky. It's like me sucky now, mommy. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy's mouth. <laughs> That's it. This is like the. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. Anyway, the McDonald's sign looks super old. All right, we just got to Miami. This says "open bitch," and this says "when excited we squirt." No, you guys can't see it. Oh, that's cool. We're headed towards downtown right now. We found a uh, a hotel down here. We were gonna get one right near the beach, but there was literally nowhere to park. It's brutal. I mean, today's a Friday, right? So kind of makes sense. All right, we're just checking into our hotel right now, getting our room. I thought this was pretty cool. Here we are. Let's check it out. No lights. Are no lights. Oh my god, it's freezing. Oh god. We gotta turn on all the lights in here. It's dark. Oh, it's nice. It smells like smoke. Yeah, we had some chain smokers in here. How do these go on? Wait, where's the light switches? Oh, <laughs> that that adds a lot. <laughs> it does. I've never walked into a hotel room. Oh wow. I never walked into a hotel room that the lights were off. I guess they're conserving energy out here for once. I guess so. It's yeah, nice. We can sleep in separate beds. Oh yay. <laughs> Cody can come and cuddle in that one. No. Nah, Cody got his own room. Cool. Yeah. 
Yeah, 64, let's uh, let's, let's turn, oh, wait a minute, I'm confused. 45. Oh my God. Wait a minute, no way. It feels like 45. So this view isn't terrible. I mean, I like the city look, uh, but we just have all this nasty down I here. our view is really cute. Yeah. We have that little water view. Oh, true. Oh, okay. that's nice, that's really nice. Wacky slosh. The hotel here is interesting. You just pick your floor before you get into the elevator. You know, it's all electronic. It's pretty dope. All right, we're going to the lobby. We're trying to get food right now. There's this place in the lobby we're going to check out. Is this it right here? I think so. Oh, that's interesting. You always have to scan the barcodes now in places to eat. It brings up the menu. So we looked at the menu. We weren't really craving anything on it. So we're actually going to hit a steakhouse, which James and I came out to Miami for a day before. We were going to end up going on this cruise ship. Something happened where we ended up then going. Yeah, it's fine, brother. How you doing? Nice to meet you, bro. Oh, oh he just fell in. No way. Bro, I went to go around you and I tripped over <laughs> and my foot went right into the water. Did you, br wow. did you bring any other shoes? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's hilarious. <laughs> Bro, no way that just happened. Good thing I was still recording. I thought I stopped. I, was, I, took, I just took a picture real quick. But yeah, James and I, we went to Fleming's before. And it was like so good. Usually Fleming's in Jersey is like, ants. you know, it's a steakhouse. It's, it's, it was okay. Out here, it was like next level. It was so good. You're hyping this shit up, so let's see. Look, it was really good for me. Hopefully, it's it's just as good as it was when I came here before. Better than Black Rock? I don't know. Nothing. I don't think it. I don't think it beats that. But it was really good. I can't remember. It's been like two years. So I just know we were starving. Usually things taste better, obviously, when you're starving. But it was good. And there's only two of them around here, so we have a 50/50 chance of actually going to the one that I went to. <laughs> but I looked at like the street view, which is actually really cool. Um, the new iOS 15 update, you can see like a whole street. Let me just show you. All right, so I typed in Flemings. Now if I hit this in the bottom left hand corner, these goggles, you can actually see a full street view like this. Like that is so sick. So yeah, looking at the pictures, I think it was the same one that we went to before. We're just gonna sit on this blue couch while we're waiting for Cody to get changed. The whole back of his pants are soaked. Yeah, and his whole shoe. Dude, how did that happen? It was so funny. You know, that was like me earlier today. So Cody had like these little weights on the floor. I was coming out of the bedroom and you were walking by and I didn't pay attention and I was trying to get around you and I stubbed my toe. <laughs> so it's kind of like the same thing. He was trying to get around me and he stepped and slipped into the freaking water. <laughs> oh no, they're cleaning up the wetness. I feel bad. <laughs> Man's is still wet. <laughs> yeah, the back is wet. You want to hear some more good news? This is my only pair of socks I brought. <laughs> so I, my feet are going to be stinking on the ride home on Sunday. Dang. Yeah. Life, life is good. I probably got some socks you can fit into. Oh wow, that building is nice. We are totally underdressed right now for this place. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it's a fancy place, but it's whatever. We just called while we were in the car because we forgot like, oh, it's Friday night. They probably don't have anything available. But we came in and they said they can have a table ready in like 15 minutes, which is clutch because I am so excited right now. We just sat down, got the menu. Of course, you know, I'm getting the 11 ounce filet. We're all going to get the same exact uh, cocktail, blueberry lemon drop. It sounds good. So with your bread, you get pumpkin spice butter and champagne butter. This butter right here is so good. It almost tastes like cream cheese. This one's pretty good too. I'm not a big fan of pumpkin, but it's nice. I like that they do that for like the season. Yeah. We just got our drink. It's in like a martini glass. It's frosted a little bit. Looks pretty good. It's good. You like it? It is strong. It's strong. But it's good. But the sugar around the outside, it kind of like... It levels it out, yeah. I guess I'm just... I guess so. It's, it's good though. <laughs> well, definitely getting my money's worth with this. It's strong. It's very strong. Back to old LA vibe where we both just pick up our camera at the, the same, same time. time. Yeah, we're both walking again. We back up from yep. different point of views. Yeah. Every time. We would do that in Vegas all the time. We would both record the same exact thing. It was good to be back on the ground. I feel, I feel happy. Of course, we have to get more bread, but there's none left of the butter that we like. Well, I'll eat this one. Okay, so funny story. When we first walked in, the people knew who we were from like the videos and everything, which is pretty dope. I think they helped us get a table a little bit faster than we probably would have. But they just came to our table and they're hooking us up with free shots, which is sick. So shout out to Flemings in Miami. You're Appreciate y'all. You're definitely going to be wasted. Oh, 100%. Yeah. You're definitely yeah. going to be wasted. Sounds like a fun night. Drunk lads, let's go. Hey, let's go. We got some shots Thank coming you. in. All day, baby. Thank you, I appreciate Tell you. Jersey represent. Hell yeah. Oh, we got it frosted too. Is that salt though? 
It might yeah. be salt this time. Salt. With yep. the lime. Some, assuming tequila, right? Yes. Yeah. It's Casamigos. Oh, sweet. And it's not Casamigos. You can probably cut this out. It's not a cheap tequila. Yeah. No, the, 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 oh, yeah, they're hooking us up. There we go. Why is your shape like that and mine shape like this? Mine's butterfly, so they cut it in half so they can make it well done more instead of like less pink. Oh, yeah, because you like your steak like a leather boot. Yeah, like a tire. Mine still moves. Did yeah. you hear that? Yeah, it's beating. We got some potatoes and mac and cheese. And some mac and cheese. I know they got a salad tonight. Expectation met. This is so good. How was yours? Dude, it's it's just melting in my mouth. It's fire. Wow, completely devoured. Completely devoured. <laughs> Did you like it though? Yeah, it was good. And uh, mac and cheese, absolutely fire. The potatoes, they were okay. I give it like a seven. Um, these, this ten was, out of ten. Yeah, fire, ten. for real, for real. Drinks completely gone for Cody and I, and uh, Julia's still sipping. I always forget about my drinks. Yeah, just down it. <laughs> I would be absolutely blasted. I'll drink it. I know you will. Let me just sip one. Go ahead. Lance is already strong. You should probably chug that to yourself. I'm pretty drunk right now. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. And the night just keeps getting better. They're hooking up a dessert for us, bro. You hype? Yeah, I'm not on the diet right now. Hell no. You hype? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. sick. Is that lava cake? Yeah, yeah we're doing a flame boy star. Let's go. I'm about to set it on fire. Oh, oh it's going to, we're going to light it on fire. Let's yeah. go. Woo! Oh, man. You keep turning. You keep turning to the whole glass is hot. I have no idea what we're about to eat, but uh, it's on fire. Right? It's on fire. It's, 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 it's on fire. <laughs> it's fire. Yo, that's fire. Damn. For real. Oh, yeah. It is fire. Lava cake vibes. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> so we're trying out the new macro lens on the iPhone 13. And as you can see, you can get very, very close-up shots. Like, wow. the diamond just looks incredible this close-up. That's insane. This is a really interesting straw. Apparently it's biodegradable. It's got like these different specs in it. That is a giant burrito. Yeah. Good luck. I'm scared. Wow, this looks cracked out. Julie and I are splitting this. My sandwich just came out. It's like a waffle and egg sandwich with bacon ham. Breakfast was good. I am completely stuffed now. Yes. Now we're gonna head over to a beach, which we just stepped outside and it's like drizzling. So that's gonna start raining soon, I guess. We got a Rolls Royce truck looking clean. This Corvette literally looks like a Ferrari. Like it's so similar. This sun over here in Florida, especially Miami, just hits different. It is so bright. It is insane. But wow, this beach that we just came to looks beautiful. Wow, that is gorgeous. We just rented an umbrella and chairs. Watch out, everybody. Beached whale. Wow. <laughs> she looks Man's is floating right now. <laughs> He's just chilling. He's been here for like three minutes so far. I've been trying to get his attention, but he don't care. Look at the robot. I know. He's so like calm and content. Well, the beach was fun. Now it's raining, so we just left. We just came out to dinner and we got the whole place to ourselves. Let's go. I rented it out for us. Oh wow, you're the best, babe. Yeah. Thank you. Alright, well today's our last day in Miami. We just checked out the hotel. We're gonna go grab some breakfast and then uh Oh that is bright. Oh god, I can't. Dude, you know, Florida sun, I've said it a lot, it's it's intense. So we're stopping right now for a refill in the Tesla. We're looking around, Julia and I, we're like, up, yeah. we, why do we recognize this area? This is actually the area that Julia's family used to live in in Naples, which yeah. is sick. This is so weird. We would literally come over in this area all the time. Yeah, that's crazy. That's so it was weird. so weird. Out of all places we stopped here, which I know. Is like we're, we were literally always here. I love it here. We stopped at a high usage supercharging station, and look, it charges like almost 700 miles in an hour. That's actually ridiculous, dude. Yeah. Yeah, it'll go down like the more the battery goes up this goes down can you change your current mm. like your amount of amps or no no that's it's stuck it's like maxed out yeah. yeah normally it's like 48 this one's only 33 so oh that's weird and then it tells you how much it costs when you're charging it yeah like we just got 10 miles for a dollar that's sick it's like not bad yeah we were back at cody's apartment and he is about to set up the new monitor let's go i need a screwdriver i just woke up from a nap too by the way my contacts are literally 
fucking cemented to my eyeballs right now. Yeah, I fell asleep with my contacts in. Screwdriver. Uh, what are, you, what are you looking at me for? I don't live here. You didn't pack one in your toolbox? Why would I do that? I don't know, you're Tim the Toolman Taylor. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> yeah, Just shave, shave it off. <laughs> <laughs> Get a butter knife. I think these might be too tight to use a butter knife. Get a screwdriver. <laughs> I don't have a fucking <laughs> screwdriver. Mm. I could probably do somewhere. You're not a real man. Only real men have screwdrivers. Well, I guess I'll just go f myself then. You should. Well, I guess he has a real man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm using a flathead on a Phillips. That's how real men do it. Yeah, I like sticking it in where things don't fit. <laughs> 27 inch, 24 inch. Let's hope it fits in his setup area. It should. 2 inch. 2 inch. 1.5. I was just about to say two <laughs> inch and point to you. Wow. Yeah, me. He, he, got, he got to it first. Me and Cody matching. We're, we're packing. We're twinning. We're definitely packing. I mean, together it's four inches, so it's pretty killer. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get both at the same time. Yeah, you know? it's it's a killer combo. <laughs> It's like a number nine off the fucking Burger King menu. <laughs> this dude goes to Burger King so much he knows the fucking menu off his heart. <laughs> yeah, so what? Mind your goddamn business. I don't tell you how to live your life. You actually do. How? You told me to move down here. <laughs> <laughs> I know! <laughs> Alright, here's the reveal. Does it fit? Oh yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah, it's a little heavy. I gotta fucking tighten this fucking thing. Yeah, it's a big mile. I don't have like a wrench, I don't think. <laughs> oh, this man got nothing. Get you a man that has nothing. No power tools, nothing. Yeah, it's the That's best you. kind of man. Yeah, that, it literally is. You go to your dad's house for it. Yeah, it's convenient. They're right next door. <laughs> Let me see if I have a wrench. Wow, the man does have the tools. Surprisingly, I had a wrench that fits. So I really sold a lot of my tools when I stopped working on my car and I blew my motor. And then now I have a Tesla, so what do I need tools for? I don't know, basic necessities like this. <laughs> eh, nah, f*** it. I'll just call the tool guy. Hey Lance, can you come over? Is it bigger? It's 27 inches. Kind of hard to tell. My contacts are also still very I mean, tall. 24 to 27 isn't a giant difference. A girl will leave you for an extra three inches, Lance. Well, when we're comparing <laughs> one inch to four inches, yeah, that's, <laughs> yes, that's giant. Yes. <laughs> but 24 to 27, eh, maybe not so much. <laughs> Evacuate the room, Cody, just bust it out. I hope it doesn't my, smell I hope that my breath. bad. It, it, you it, just it. enjoyed the smell of your own farts. Dude, it sounded wet as shit. <laughs> that's how every fart of Cody sounds. Yeah, it's because I got a loose bug wall. Give me a break. God. <laughs> Looking icy so far. I think my mouse is dead. Yeah, considering we haven't been here in a couple days. Wacky slosh. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, that looks so much better already. Yeah, this monitor is huge. That extra three inches really does make a difference. <laughs> I guess so. Thanks, all right, I'm going to bed. So you... <laughs> you were just sleeping for like two hours. I think you're good. No, I wasn't. I only slept for like an hour. I heard you get home. Oh. And then I was like, yo, I hope he doesn't come and like ask me to set up the monitor right now. Nah. And then I, I fell asleep. Yeah, I was working out. So was I. Yeah. Wow. This looks 95 million times better than what my old one looked like. Right? So much better. Hell yeah. Dude, I'm actually going to be able to see the enemies now. For real. <laughs> I won't have a 0.3 KD. Oh, dude, it looks so good. So obviously we are in a Tesla right now. Cody and I really wanted to try this out. On the screen while you're driving, it'll tell you when a human is passing by, when a bicyclist is passing by. Like It shows you a physical image of it happening in real time. And we wanted to try Try going to a cemetery and seeing if it'll pick up people walking by when we're in the cemetery when they're really just probably spirits. We saw a TikTok of people going and driving around the cemetery and it shows people actually walking by and there's nobody there and it's creepy as hell. So it's kind of going to be like a factor cap thing. Yeah, for real. We're going to try it out and see if, you know, if it works. Yo, if this actually works, I'm going to be very creeped out. Na, 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 na. Hello there, Johnny. Okay, now I'm definitely creeped out. <laughs> we can just go back to the apartment right now. <laughs> we are pulling up now to the cemetery. You want to get out and walk so they can see what it looks like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, give me your camera and I'll record right. on both. So Lance just walked by. You saw he just popped up for a second. Do it again. It's like, it's like glitching right now. Yeah. It like doesn't even know where we are, yeah. No, you didn't, oh, yep, you, you're, uh, yep. See how it popped up on the screen right there? Yeah, you see it keeps popping up, so. Yeah, it had to be a little further. That's yeah, right now. Um, so we're gonna, we're gonna cruise around the cemetery. Dude, it even shows you, you getting, getting into in my car, car yeah. Wow. Well, let's drive through here and, uh, and see what happens. I feel like we probably, dude, see, it's like freaking out right now. Yeah. Like has no idea where we are. I'm actually kind of nervous right I now. I know. 
I got like this weird feeling. I used to get these same feelings with uh, when you would play the fucking Ouija, Ouija board. board yeah. I know. It literally picks up the trash cans. That's on that the far. That's yeah. pretty far. Hopefully, I'm not going too fast. Should I stop for a second and just see? Yeah, let's just. Yes, go real slow. Like a mile an hour. I'm also not really paying too much attention to the screen right now. I'm more focused on driving so I don't hit anything. Yeah. I mean, if you guys see anything that pops up, make sure you let me know, but I haven't seen anything yet. Oh, sh something just dead. What? Dude, this man's got an erection in this cemetery, <laughs> bruh. You know, one day I drove by here and the line was so long, it's like people were dying to get in. That's fucked up. <laughs> Wow, there was a guy walking by, didn't even pick yeah, him up. There was I was gonna wait and try and yeah. confuse the viewers. Yeah, it didn't even pick him up. Danger, do not enter. That's Hello. like weird. Yeah, that's so weird. So I guess we'll just back up. Oh, put your seatbelt on, will you? Yeah. Yeah, because it freaking, this thing won't go away unless oh. you put your seatbelt on. Jeez. There's probably been mad ghosts. There's probably like a line of ghosts behind, behind the us. car right now. Yeah, there you go. Now it's gone. Do you want to try going to a different cemetery sure. maybe? Yeah. It's a Sunday night. I probably got work in the morning, so. It's fucking an aisle tonight. <laughs> <laughs> We're fucked up. <laughs> They're all going to come now. <laughs> yeah. Man, this okay. cemetery's dead. <laughs> I wonder if we could go to like a haunted cemetery. Yeah. Or somewhere haunted. I was thinking that too, like a house or something. Just drive in the house. <laughs> <laughs> drive right through the front of the house. Yeah. I heard that Conjuring house is up for sale for 1.2 mil. You gonna buy it? No. Maybe because we have the lights on, you're scaring them all away. Yeah, turn off your front lights. <laughs> <laughs> so we don't know where we're going. There's nothing in here, dude. Uh, we're gonna head to the next cemetery. So the place we're going to now is called Manatee Burying Ground. There's gotta be something there. Oh. I don't think this is it. This is like a school like a park. Yeah, right here. I have not seen like an entrance for this thing. Is the only way that you can walk in through the gate? Say so you know how that that gate was on the corner. Yeah. Is there not a driveway in there? I don't I don't think it so. It doesn't look like it. No. Jeez. Maybe we should go to an actual cemetery then. <laughs> My bad. Third time's a charm. We got another one pulled up. We're almost there, but imagine living next to a cemetery. It's kind of creepy. Yeah, this is kind of like a creepy area, I feel like. Yeah. I don't know. I wouldn't want to live over here. <laughs> this looks really creepy. I agree. Yeah, this looks creepy. Dude, I'm getting chills right now. Turn on your high beams. We didn't even think of that. I don't know how to turn them on all the way. Yeah, it's that. Yeah, but that I have to hold that. Really? Yeah, in order for it to be like on. that. Yeah. Oh, your heart sounds cool backwards. Yeah, it sounds like a spaceship. No vehicles beyond this point, so I guess we'll turn and go this way. I haven't seen anything yet. Really I mean, there's anything. hella, so we should have seen something by now. I mean, driving through cemeteries, regardless, this is still pretty creepy. Yeah. Gate closes in on us. Oh, could you imagine? I'd floor my Tesla right <laughs> through it. <laughs> yeah, I think it's cab. Just cop after you. Fuck. Oh, no. I just said the other day that I didn't want to get pulled over. How you doing? I have okay. all my information for you. Do you know what the speed limit is here? Yeah, it's like 40. 35. 35. It's my first time getting pulled over in Florida. You know your social security number? Yeah, why do you need all that? Uh, because I've got to write you a criminal citation. What's a criminal citation? Criminal citation is a method of charging a person with a com committing a criminal offense without going through the standard formalities of arrest, fingerprinting, processing, taking an individual before a judge to be arraigned and posting a bond. A citation in itself is not a criminal charge. It simply means you have been cited for a charge. If you are convicted or plead guilty to a criminal charge, that will stay on your record. The most common citations are traffic citations. In the majority of cases, traffic offenses are classified as minor offenses. You want to step out of the car for me so I can have you sign this? Sure. Why do you have to step out of the car to sign it? That's so weird. What is, is there a charge? What's it say? I'd have to go to court. Fuck, I feel so bad right now. It's all good. So we're in Cody's garage right now. We're going to try and charge up the Tesla using the charger that it comes with. That's plugged in. Do that like so. Yeah, it's charging like one or two miles an hour. Yeah, and now it's saying three miles an hour when the door is closed. I know a lot of you have questions about what's going on with the apartment situation. I have all the info to give you, but you have to wait till the next video. So make sure to subscribe and turn on my notifications so you don't miss it. We got a lot of really good news coming up. But that is gonna do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up button and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.